Tim Barker. I'm the National Commercial Manager for FSI Limited. One of, if not the biggest manufacturer of passive fire protection products, stroke systems in certainly the UK, if not Europe. So yeah, we were involved years ago, we were, a lot of our products and systems were involved with the Shard. Uh, and more recently, everyone knows this, Battersea Power Station in London, Leadenhall Street, Nine Elms, um, Bishop's Gate, which was a, quite a big one, lots of, lots of projects down there. We cover the whole of the UK, Ireland, Europe, the rest of the world, over to Australia, New Zealand. We ensure that all of our products are third party certified and that we deal with third party certified installers to ensure that it's all very well having a fantastic product if it's not installed correctly. If it's installed badly, we might as well not bother. So we go through the, the, the rigorous testing that we do to ensure that products meet the requirements they need installed incorrectly by the installers. We have been members for approximately 15 years and we joined primarily because it was a it was the only one of its type that I can recall organizations that was as passionate as we were in terms of raising the bar, increasing and improving the standards that were out there in terms of pacifier protection. It's an important organisation to be part of because they are pretty much, pretty much, sorry, uh, and have been certainly over the last four or five years, the link between government legislation and the construction industry. You know, te we are part of the construction process, so they are more of the sort of governing body from the government guidelines and also the fire protection industry. Knowledge. Communication regarding the legislation, regarding what's going out there in the, in the, the big wide world of passive fire protection or fire protection and construction. It's, it's a platform where lots of other organisations within the industry can get together and talk essentially. So whether that be the ASFP themselves, manufacturers like ourselves, installers, construction companies, M&E guys, dry line, everyone can join and, and sort of have a, a free, open forum of discussion. And we're all there for the same reason, we're pushing standards and we need to keep pushing those standards. And if we've got that open platform and that open forum with the majority of people that are involved with the construction industry and we're all pushing in the same direction, eventually it'll all click and it'll work. We will be at the fire safety event in September on the 7th, 8th and 9th, all three days alongside the ASFP. We have a stand, we'll be there for the three days and myself and a colleague will be doing some talks or presenting some talks on the Wednesday and Thursday. Um, I'm doing mine for the FSM, the fire safety matters in the, in the fire hall and my colleague will be talking with Niall, I think, on the Thursday uh, on the SFP arena, just to push everything we've spoken about the last hour, the standards, the passion that we're showing, and everyone that should be watching this, and hopefully everyone that's in that auditorium or in those rooms will share that same passion and vision, and we're all driving for the same thing. So yeah, we're looking forward to that. Because we've been, everyone's been shut up for 18 months, so it'll be good to get out there and see others, see our competitors that we talk to, we speak with, they talk to us. We, so it'll be good to see everybody that's involved with the industry. I'd like to think, and I don't know, but if I have, I'd like to think I'm making a difference with in the FSI business and within the fire industry or the passive fire industry itself. Whether I am or not, that's for everyone else to judge, comment on, but I'd like, that would be an achievement. But one that I can um, 
sort of substantiate is my, is my promotion now to national commercial manager. So I look after the whole of the UK for the FSI brand, the UK and Ireland, which I'm extremely proud of because I, I still believe I uh, uphold the values that our founder started 21 years ago. I still believe, I've still got that passion that perhaps he had when he started that. So yeah, I'm quite proud of that because that's, you know, I've come back into FSI, I've been back here now five and a half years and have gone through the ranks almost. Um, so I'm quite proud of that achievement of where I am and the importance of that role is within, not just for the FSI business, but the hopeful and the possible impact I'll have within the, within the industry over the coming years. We're, we're all pushing for the same thing. Let's just keep pushing, all of us. Let's be aggressive with one another in a professional manner. Let's be passionate about it and let's make it happen.